and welcome back to the channel. As you can probably tell, it's raining here. And it's been raining for a while. And it's going to rain some more. It's just a relentless rain. It's not quite as he heavy as it's been earlier, but we've been getting our fair share of rain to the point where we've been under for a couple of days now flood watches and warnings here so I thought I'd just ride around a little bit here while we're under a flood watch or warning depending on where you're at I think we're still under a flood watch Temperature's not that bad. We're about 56 degrees, so that's fine. It's just it it's relentless as I say this rain, it just keeps on coming. I'm equipped to do okay in the rain. One thing when you're riding in the rain that I find is you get hit in the face with the raindrops and if it's colder out, it's not too bad today, but if it's colder out, that can uh, sting you pretty good. And I would suggest wearing a full uh, shield full-faced uh, helmet if you have one uh, would protect you good I've got a uh, motorcycle helmet that I have and um, so I can use that and also uh, well I don't have a microphone uh, set up inside the helmet so that's why I'm wearing this other helmet instead of the motorbike helmet but Uh, so you guys can hear me when I talk, but The motorcycle helmet I really like because it does protect you. It's a full face Helmet and also in the winter Keeps you warm too Your ears everything's completely covered so that makes a big difference Well the grass over there is still nice and green in the golf course. But that's the only real thing with the rain, you know. As long as you have your eyes protected, that's very important because I've ridden before without glasses on or for eye protection and you just can't do it. You're squinting and uh, 
it stings the eyes you can't see where you're going you have to ride really really slow so if you want some kind of eye protection especially something that can go around like goggles and protect you from the sides as well It's not windy out at the moment, so that sure helps too. But. The camera, I notice, if you come out in the rain, you can't really tell so much on the camera. It doesn't pick it up as well. So it may not look like it's raining that hard. And you, sometimes you can't even tell. You could probably hear it hitting my jacket, but. But uh, when I left this morning, just after five o'clock a.m. for work, uh, the rain was really coming down, but it's not coming down quite as hard right now, so but it's still raining pretty good. But it was really coming down. I think several people ride in the rain. Some people don't ride in the rain. I don't think we have any in-betweeners too much. I think you either got the riders that ride in the rain or they don't ride. I don't think we have some that are 50-50 unless you get caught out in the rain and have no choice. I think people pretty much have their minds made up if they're a rain rider, e-bike rider, or bicycle, whichever, and, uh, or they're not. They just shut it down on rainy days, but. But I don't mind it as long as the bike is okay with it and I'm dressed appropriately. And it probably would depend for me too on how far I, I am going. If I was going a long way, I wouldn't like it so much, but if you're riding shorter distances, then not so bad. But if you had a long ride, that might give you a little bit of pause. Um, depends on the situation, how stormy it is out there. And the only time I wouldn't want to ride in the rain is if there's a uh, lightning. If you're in the middle of a, a pretty good thunderstorm or obviously a tornado, you're not gonna ride, I would hope. But uh, under regular rain though, it's okay. Thunderstorm, not so much. You know, there are times you could be out and get caught in a thunderstorm, unexpected, you know. But uh, I don't think I'd want to venture out if there's lightning striking all around, you know. That's not wise or safe. that's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and thank you very much for doing that. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining me for this video. And until next time.